Hey guys, welcome to Hutton's Computer Repair. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can enable the color filters hotkey on Windows 10. Now, what the color filters are is a nice feature that helps out people based on older age or color structures of what they see on the computer. And you can change the colors into like inverted, as you remember that on Windows XP, there were little commands for that <laughs> tech thing. Um, another feature that you can do is enable it gray and inverted gray and other stuff like that or different color structures. Now to do this you can actually just simply type in the control Windows key and C and it instantly disables it into a gray layout and you can see it literally is gray. And if you want to change it to a different structure you would then have to do these few steps. You would have to go to start, go to settings, and then you will go to ease of access. On the left side you'll see a location where it says color and high contrast. From there, you can choose what filter you want to have. The grayscale is the default one. If you want to have inverted, you'll press it and select. And here you have it. You can use that same command, Control, Windows, Key, and C. And C does it super quick. And if you want to change it to a different one, like the grayscale inverted, here you go. So it's inverted, but also in gray. You can change it to a different color structures that are right here. Some of them have like a different look. Like these are kind of like a bluish gray view. And there's these other couple ones right here. This one looks like a more darker blue. You see bluish, the red and pink are kind of like changed colors. The greenish also. And there's another one here also that's more brighter. So you can really see the colors brighten out. But you can choose one that you want the best. I'm going to go ahead and use the grayscale inverted because like why not? And there you have it. Now to simply learn the hotkey, you'll do, again, the control, Windows key, and C. And there you have it. And it's basically that simple. Thank you for watching from Helton's Computer Repair, and I'll see you on our next video.